I uh, welcome now John Leach. Uh, thanks for joining us. You are the CEO of Shelterbox, and of course, we want to know what exactly is that. Well, Shelterbox is a disaster relief charity. We're we're part of the Rotary family. We're a Rotary project partner, um, but essentially, we deliver essential life-saving supplies in the form of a, a family tent to those people in need, uh, particularly after those sort of man-made and and uh, natural disasters. That's quite great. We can see some boxes here. What what is uh, the box made of? So what what are the the uh, points you can find in the box? Yeah, so it's, it's a large plastic box and, and we essentially put everything in a box to make it easy to transport, particularly at the far end. A lot of these disasters, you know, there's no infrastructure, the roads are down. Uh, the key component of the box is the is the disaster relief tent. It's a tent that's been specifically designed for us, which has been evolved over the years, and it's designed for a, for a family um, and to give them emergency shelter after a disaster. But in that we put in other sort of non-food items that we put in there, so cooking set, stove, blankets, all the essential things to give people shelter warmth and dignity. I guess uh, there are a lot, a lot of areas already where uh, shelter box is used. Can you give us uh, some uh, hot spots of that? Certainly, yeah. I mean, uh, shelter box really grew after the Indian Ocean tsunami in 2004-2005. Uh, so that was a, a huge boost uh, to shelter box. Uh, but, but more recently, the, the earthquake in Haiti. Um, you're still delivering shelter boxes. You know, uh, several years after that, there's still a desperate need. Um, we have uh, shelter box teams, response teams working in uh, northern Iraq, working with the Syrian refugees, uh, Africa, uh, the the tsunami in Japan. So all the all the big disasters you will have heard of on the news, and, and many many that you don't hear about. All around the world. That's nice. So at the end, can you give us a kind of call to action? How can I, as a Rotarian or even a non-Rotarian, participate and support the project? Certainly. I mean, and, and fundraising is the lifeblood of what we do, and we are very, you know, we're very well supported by Rotary clubs around the world. But we need, we need more. The more money we have, the more we can do. So there's always opportunities for people to help us, to support, to donate, uh, Rotary clubs, projects, uh, but also to speak, to talk to people about what we do. But get involved, whatever you do. Thanks a lot for the message. Thanks a lot for explanation. We'll have a closer look later on and uh, of course uh, we want to tell our audience that they can support anytime, everywhere, no problem. Uh, it's, the money will spend uh, in the right way. Absolutely. Perfect. Right. Thanks Thank a lot. You. Bye. Bye-bye.